1. Which of the following best describes the primary purpose of the IC3 Digital Literacy Certification? A. To measure advanced programming knowledge. B. To assess fundamental digital literacy skills. C. To evaluate professional-level IT certifications. D. To certify networking and cybersecurity expertise. 2. In digital communication, what is the main advantage of using cloud-based email services? A. They provide unlimited storage without cost. They allow access from multiple devices with internet connection. C. They guarantee email encryption by default. D. They automatically delete spam without user input. 3. Which file format is most commonly used for compressing images without losing quality? A. JPEG B. PNG C. GIF D. BMP or, which of the following is considered good digital security practice? A. Writing passwords in a notebook for easy access. B. Using the same password for multiple accounts. C. Enabling two-factor authentication. D. Disabling software updates to avoid disruptions. 5. In spreadsheet applications, which function would you use to calculate the average of a set of numbers? A equals sum. B equals count. C equals average. D equals max. 6. Which shortcut is typically used to paste copied content in most operating systems? A. Control X. B. Control V. C. Control plus C. D. Control P. 7. Which of the following is an example of cloud storage? A. USB flash drive. B. Google Drive. C. External hard disk. D. DVD. 8. In presentation software, the term transition refers to A. The movement of text within a slide. B. The effect applied when moving between slides. C. The background design template. D. The animation of images. 9. Which device is considered an input device? A. Monitor. B. Keyboard. C. Printer. D. Projector. 10. In digital citizenship, plagiarism refers to a. Saving documents in multiple locations. B. Copying and using someone else's work without credit. C. Downloading free software online. D. Encrypting sensitive documents. 11. Which of the following best describes malware? A. A legitimate program designed to increase productivity. B. A type of harmful software intended to damage systems. C. A software patch that fixes bugs. D. A network protocol used for file transfers. 12. Which unit of measurement is used to describe internet bandwidth speed? A. Megabytes per second, Mbps. Megabits per second, Mpbs. C. Kilohertz. D. Gigahertz. 13. Which of the following is not an example of an operating system? A. Windows. B. Linux. C. Android. D. Microsoft Word. 14. Which tool in word processing software helps detect spelling errors? A. Thesaurus. B. Spell Check. C. Auto Format. D. Find and replace. 15. Which of the following describes phishing? A. Attempting to obtain sensitive information through fraudulent emails or websites. E. A process of encrypting documents for security. C. A method of compressing files for easy sharing.
D, a type of cloud-based storage. 16, which protocol is most commonly used for browsing websites securely? A, HTTP. B, HTTPS. C, FTP. D, SMTP. 17. In database applications, what does a primary key represent? A. A field used to uniquely identify each record. B. The total number of fields in a table. C. A security password for accessing the database. D. A shortcut for creating queries. 18. Which of the following devices uses an IP address to connect to the Internet? A. Scanner. B. Router. C. Printer. Offline. D. Projector. 19. Which software application is best suited for creating newsletters with images and text layouts? A. Spreadsheet software. B. Desktop publishing software. C. Database management software. D. Antivirus software. 20. Which of the following is an example of cloud-based productivity software? A. Microsoft Office 2016 installed locally. E. Google Docs. C. Adobe Photoshop installed on PC. D. Notepad. 21. What does the term netiquette refer to? A. Online rules for safe shopping. B. Social and professional etiquette when communicating online. C. A protocol for file transfer. D. Cybersecurity encryption standards. 22. Which of the following storage units is the largest? A. Kilobyte. B. Megabyte. C. Gigabyte. D. Terabyte. 23. In computer networking, what does LAN stand for? A. Local Application Network. B. Large Area Network. C. Local Area Network. D. Linked Access Node. 24. Which of the following is not an example of plagiarism prevention? A. Citing sources properly. B. Paraphrasing original content. C. Copying and pasting without attribution. D. Quoting with references. 25. Which of the following is a characteristic of open source software? A. Requires expensive licensing fees. B. Source code is freely available and modifiable. C. Can only be used by corporations. D. Only runs on proprietary systems. 26. Which is the safest way to connect to a public Wi-Fi network? A. Without any security settings. B. By disabling antivirus software. C. By using a virtual private network VPN. D. By sharing passwords with others. 27. Which of the following is an advantage of using presentation software? A. Automatically performs complex statistical calculations. B. Provides a visual way to communicate information. C. Encrypts data by default. D. Generates firewall protection. 28. Which application is best used for managing customer data records? A. Spreadsheet software. B. Word processor. C. Database software. D. Presentation software. 29. Which of the following is an example of digital footprint? A. Browsing history left online. B. Hardware stored in an office. C. A printed copy of a document. D. External hard drives. 30. In digital communication, what does BCC stand for in email? A. Blind carbon copy. B. Basic cloud copy. C. Backup contact copy. D. Background communication code. 31. Which of the following is a major advantage of using online collaboration tools? 
A. Requires no internet access. E. Allows multiple users to edit and share documents in real time. C. Works only on one computer at a time. D. Automatically removes all viruses. 32. Which type of computer memory is volatile and erased when power is turned off? A. ROM B. RAM C. Hard drive D. Flash storage 33. Which of the following is not an effective method of protecting personal information online? A. Using strong and unique passwords B. Avoiding suspicious links and downloads C. Sharing private data on unsecured websites D. Adjusting privacy settings on social media. 34. Which file extension is commonly used for Microsoft Excel spreadsheets? A. .docx B. .xlsx C. .pptx D. .text .text 35. Which of the following is an example of an output device? A. Keyboard B. Microphone C. Monitor D. Scanner 36. Which of the following is an example of a strong password? A. 123456 B. Password C. Summer 2025 At D. QWERTY 37. In digital literacy, what does the term ergonomics refer to? A. Designing hardware to reduce user fatigue and injury. B. The speed of internet connectivity. C. The process of encrypting data for security. D. The use of open source applications.